everyone, welcome back. It's Melissa and Kate, and we are bringing to you today a totally random Target haul. Uh, I'll tell you why it's random, <laughs> because I came home yesterday, and I was like, well, I have to go buy Tony an anniversary gift, and I was like, do you want to come with me? She was still working, and then her boss closed work early, so she was like, I'm going. I'm going. Yes, please. <laughs> so we spent like an hour and a half in there? Oh, God. I, that store, <laughs> it's got my number. Okay, I'm just going to say that. It has my number. It sucks you in. And I just like to shop there, but I hadn't been in a really long time. Mm -hmm. So... Anyway, this is going to be a little bit of beauty, a little bit of home goods, a little bit of everything. So, yeah. so the first thing that we picked up is very similar, and they are some curling irons. I've already used mine. I have not taken mine out of the bag, the box. Mine has different packaging, but it's the same curling iron. Very similar. Mine's a one-inch barrel. Mine's Kate's is one and a fourth. And... Uh, one of the reasons why I wanted to pick up a curling iron is I'm, you know, working on hair for the wedding, mm -hmm. and I was uh, chatting with my hairdresser about it, and I told her I thought I wanted to, like, curl it a little bit, kind of, so it looks like, you know, when they wear, like, that curl bob, I'll put a few little inspiration pictures in mm -hmm. while I'm talking, but, uh, so... We were talking about that, and she's like, well, we probably need to let it grow a little bit. And, you know, I was discussing pros and cons. Flat iron, curling it with a flat iron, or curling it with a curling iron. And she said, no, your hair's too short to use a flat iron. Definitely get a curling iron and a one-inch barrel. So I got this to play with. I'm not sure whether I'm going to do my hair that day, whether Kate's going to do my hair that day. We might trade off that she does my hair and I do her hair. Yeah or whether I'm going to make an appointment and get it done. So, uh, to be continued on that front, way too much information about my hair. But Well, the, th the thing, like, with, like, deciding about that is that they're doing, their wedding's going to be at night. So we have, like, all day to all get day. ready. So that's why, like, my mom can kind of, like, plan that. But yeah. she was talking about getting a curling iron, and my curling iron that I usually use is way too big for my hair because my hair's still, like, mid-length. And I curled my hair with this this morning, and I'm in love. Yes, so I'll probably be playing a little bit later on this weekend. I like it when they have the rotating bottoms. Yeah, and it has adjustable heat. Yes, right here. Um, it takes, they say, about 30 seconds to heat up. Yeah. Which is really, really nice, and the cord is super long. Oh, and the other thing she said, you know, if you get one with a clip on it, you can still use it it's like a, a curling wand, wand mm -hmm. and just put it over the clip, so... Should I ever decide to get longer hair? Well, someone always, people will say like, oh, that leaves creases. That's not, I've never had creases on my hair when I've used it as a wand with a clip on. So, anyway, that, that was the thing we got similar. Yes. It's the same, it's the same thing, different sizes, different packaging. Yeah. All right, why don't you go next? What do you need to okay, I guess I'll just, I'll get Tony's stuff out of the way. I'll do. The whole reason for going there, besides so, the curling iron. He... <laughs> he's a very big Disney fan, and he collects the Disney movies, so he's trying to get all of them on Blu-ray. So I bought him Sleeping Beauty, which just came out. And, um, yeah. So. I don't know. There's nothing really special about it. It's just Sleeping Beauty. And it's an anniversary gift? It's, yeah. Our anniversary is the 21st of March, so. I'm not going to be with him on our anniversary, but this is what I got him. Okay. He told me that's what he wanted, so. <laughs> So as we were wandering around Target, as, I found this. as you do when you go to Target, they had, and I don't show candles very often on my channel, but they had these multi-colored candles, but they're also multi-fragrance. And this is from Yankee Candle, and it's Watermelon Days, White Sands, and Harbor Breeze. Harbor Breeze. So it's just... It smells so good. It smells delish. So, and I thought, oh, this would be great during the summer. Like, it's very patriotic. So, you I know. Was, I was suckered into the candle aisle, and I said, Mom, come here. <laughs> and she bought one. So I had to buy that, and I'll put it aside for the month of July to burn it then. Mm -hmm. So, yeah. Totally random. All right. The next thing I got for Tony. <laughs> this is such a joke. But um, he he just moved into a new apartment, and he bought, like, liquid dish 
soap, like the, like Dawn, okay? And he was like, well, I thought that was for your dishwasher. It's not. So I buy these, the Cascade Completes, and I bought them for him and ever since then he's been like, well, I don't know what kind you buy. So I just got him a small pack of them as a joke because I, I, that day when he was putting his first lot of dishes into his dishwasher and he was like starting, I was like, no, 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 no. Oh my God, what a mess that would have been. I was like, you, no. He's lucky, <laughs> he's lucky that you were there. Yeah. Cause, oh my God, if you've ever done that, oh, it makes, you get soap every, suds everywhere. It mm -hmm. just, and it can really destroy your dishwasher, FYI. Yeah. So, poor little Tony. Poor Tony. He's a little helpless sometimes. <laughs> All right. So the next thing we picked up were <laughs> some very exciting lint rollers. Uh, we're going to share this pack, but mostly because uh, we have a little white dog that lives in this house. And uh, in case you couldn't tell, black is the core of my wardrobe and Kate's. And it black gets, and Navy. It's, it's <laughs> everywhere. Even when you don't like touch the dog, all of a sudden you get to work and you're like, I'm covered in flipping dog hair. So well, my thing is that Kiefer generally tends to ride in my car a lot with me, and so I'll get out of my car. He won't even sit near me. <laughs> and so I'll anyway, be these are for the car. So the yes. two cars. Yes. All right. Well, I guess I'll just go into doing these too. So I'm going on a train ride for spring break to go see Tony, and I have like some homework to do, but like. It's Not enough for seven hours it's of sitting there. It's a long train ride. So um, I picked up some magazines and I got Cosmo with Hillary Duff on it. That's Hillary? Yeah, that's oh. Hillary. Mm -hmm. Dang, she looks good. Yeah, normally I get these on my Kindle, but... Yeah, sometimes you want a real... Yeah, and I use my Kindle a lot on the train, so it gives me like a chance to like mix up what I'm doing. Right, so you don't so. get eye fatigue from that. What's the other one you got? Oh. Um, oh, no, no. <laughs> Whoops. Um, I also got 17. This is Megan Trainer. Um, it's all about the base. Yeah, I still read this. Not really for any purpose other than, like, getting more, like, inspiration to do things. Mm -hmm. I don't think this is a fantastic magazine, so, but that's just me. Yeah, you're too old for it. I am too old for it. But I know plenty of, like, YouTubers that I watch who are, like, in it, so sometimes it's funny, and I'll be like, oh my god! There she is. There's Megan. And it's weird. To me sometimes, because I'm like, I know those people, because I see them on my computer. They're my friends. They're my internet friends. <laughs> sometimes. Wow, you have a, like, okay. I got... She was time to restock. So the next thing I picked up, I'm gonna go into some beauty stuff. Okay. So the next thing I picked up was this um, Sonia Kashuk all covered up concealer. <coughs> I don't know why I didn't take it out of the box. The box is not very interesting. Um, and I should have used this today and I didn't. The color I got was porcelain. porcelain. She opened up two of them and was like this in the store, holding them against her face. This is really creamy. That's going to work very well for you. I think that was the right choice. Hopefully that we will show. We were between porcelain and ivory. So, I can't wait to try that now. So, yeah, I thought I would give this a try, you know. Concealers. Always trying new ones. Mm -hmm. Because oh, yeah. I'm looking for that absolutely perfect one that's going to make me look 20 years younger. When I find it, I'll let you know. <laughs> okay, your turn. All right, so again, because I'm traveling, <laughs> I like that's like the premise of this. Um, I got some of the St. Ives Fresh Skin Apricot Scrub in the travel size um, because I generally being, it's just like being in an airplane where you're on recycled air so you get sick which is gross, and then you really get, you get dry, so this yeah. will help take care of the dry factor of that. I hope you have some hand sanitizer, too. Mom, I'm the hand sanitizer queen. Okay, just checking. I, like, load up on that stuff. All right, I'm going to show these next two things together. Okay. So I also picked up some of the L'Oreal Infallible Eyeshadows mm -hmm. in the color Iced latte and smoldering plum smoldering plum so 
I'm also, you know, starting to think about how I'm going to wear my makeup on the wedding day. She's more ahead than I am. I'm more ahead of the bride. Just saying. <laughs> <laughs> so I've been kind of clipping some Instagram pictures for some inspiration. Mm -hmm. And I'm kind of toying with the idea of doing a little bit of a smoky plum look with the dress. The dress is uh, black lace with a nude um, lining. So I have been clipping some very fancy eye looks that I will not be able to totally replicate, but I'm looking to be inspired by. So I picked these up for that purpose, and mm -hmm. I'll be playing with these as time permits. I own Ice Latte, and it's my favorite. Uh, you know what? Uh, I'm supposed to mm, speak. I don't know who I was watching, and they were talking about Ice Latte, and they were like, this is my favorite shadow, and she wears it as like a, a cheek highlighter, too. I've done that. So, and it's just a really good neutral. Well, I'm excited about that. It's really pretty. These are great shadows. Mm -hmm. I have like a taupey one that I like quite a bit. Yeah. Yeah. So, um, along with traveling, I feel like after this, I'll really be done talking about it. I picked up some of the Jergens Ultra Healing Extra Dry Skin Moisturizer in the travel section because my skin is always dry. And this soaks in so fast. My mom used it yesterday it's with nice. me. Mm -hmm. And I just put it on right before we started filming and it's, it's already soaked in. Yeah. I like this. Target has such a great travel section. Mm -hmm. It's big. There's a lot of different choices there. And it's nice to go there when you're mm -hmm. looking for smaller things to travel with. Essie just came out with their new Flowerista, I think, is their spring collection. I think that's the name of it. Um, Something like that. Yeah, it's all flower-based. And I was watching someone who swatched all the colors, and this color spoke to me. And this is Blossom Dandy. And I, I swatched it yesterday, but I took it off because we were going out and I didn't want to look weird. But um, this, she said it like is comparable to Mint Candy Apple, but this is more blue. That's more green. This is more blue. And it's really pretty. It matches the lettering on my It's shirt. really pretty. And that is... That's my color. That's one of your favorite colors to wear. It matches my phone case. Perfectly. Well, that's important. <laughs> Not really, but you know. Okay, so in my travels through the store, I found this ginormous tote. I found it. Kate found it. Um, it is just very plain. It doesn't have any kind of pockets or anything inside, but you know, I am a, a commuter. I'm on the train every day, so it's huge. I'm looking for something that I can, you know, maybe put up my shoes in and wear street shoes or maybe bring my lunch or um, whatever. And it is... I'm going to let you do that because I'm scared. So it's break gray it. on the outside. Oh. Did I just hit you? <laughs> <laughs> Whoops. I'm sorry. <laughs> so sorry. <laughs> so it's white. <laughs> I'll just hold it up. It takes up the whole screen. So it's gray on the outside, but it is reversible, and it's black on the inside. You can see the little gray popping out. I think that's really cute. Yeah. She was worried about the straps because it comes right up underneath her armpit, but I have a tote bag like that that I use for school, and I've never had a problem with it. You get used to it. So I thought even this would be great for, like, traveling, and then it's like two bags in one. Oh, yeah. So... Anyway, I'm looking forward to test driving this. Definitely. Yes, I am. Awesome. Next. So I picked up, I'm going to do these two together because they go together anyway. Um, I picked up more of my favorite True Match stuff. So I just have the, the liquid makeup. I'm an N2. And then I also got the concealer, which is, it's in N1, 2, and 3, but like, I use this every day, and I love it. How Both do you like them. that concealer? I like this a lot, but you like unless you buy it lighter, you should not use this under your eyes. It makes it like you then look like you don't have any dimension to your face. Oh, it's too matchy matchy. You need yeah. to have something a little lighter. Which is why I use the Instant Age Rewind stuff because it's lighter. 
and it I get that nice, that nice highlight. Nice highlight. So uh, I'm still searching for art for my bathroom, mm -hmm. and I saw these uh, in Target. I really love them. However, I don't think they're going to work in my bathroom. But we're going to show you anyway. But I'm going to show you anyway, and I'm probably going to keep them anyway because I think they're really pretty. We'll find a place for them. So there we go. This is it's like they're painted on the inside of the glass. No, this one's on paper. Is it on paper? Yeah, those are, that's the other one. Oh, okay. So that's that one. This is the first thing we've ever gone to Target and we've had like a good experience in their artwork section. This is when they're painted on the glass. And these so, are so these pretty. are two individual ones. I think they're so, so pretty. They're a little too blue for what I want. Well, I recommended that like she could bring like the flower ones into her office at work. Or mom, you could even like use them in here. Put them in here. So I'm gonna keep them because you know they're not a ton of money, and I think I will definitely find a place to hang them mm -hmm. sometime in the future. And I really love them. They're just not quite right for the bathroom. Yeah. Oh well. It happens. You gotta bring it home sometimes to look at it to make sure. It was a stretch, but it's like, if I don't bring it home, I'm gonna be mad. Yeah. It was one of those things. Yeah. So. Are you done now? I am done. Okay, then I'm gonna power through these last three things. I bought um, more of the NYX matte finish spray because... It's great. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I like the dewy one better, but this is all that they had, but I really needed a finishing spray because if I don't, walking around campus, yeah. it runs. So that's unfortunate. And then I already opened this, but I put it back in the box and it's the L'Oreal Double Extend Beauty Tubes Mascara in black. Oh, <laughs> everyone has seen this. It's a prime. White side first, then use the color. Yeah. It's great. And then last, I just bought a new round brush because mine is... They get nasty after very, a while. Very gross. So, and I'm also learning how to like blow out my hair. So it's better when you have something that's actually gonna work nicely mm -hmm. than something that you've had for years. Okay. Gross. Yeah. That's it. That's it. That's our Target haul, our totally <laughs> random Target haul, but that's how Target is. You suck in and you end up buying a whole bunch of other stuff. Oh, I forgot my shoes. Oh, yes! The reason I already wore these. I wore them last night right after I bought them. But I picked up a pair of fake Chucks <laughs> at uh, Target. These are super cute. They have, um, they're like pinstripe on the inside. You see that? I just thought these were kind of fun and funky and... I don't know. And I, I was just on the, the website looking at them in gray. And then we were in Target, and I'm like, oh, okay, you're mine. So, yeah. Just something fun. I think you could wear these with, like, casually with, like, a little skirt during the summer. I see people do it all the time. Yeah, I think that could be kind of fun. Like, I wear my vans with dresses. Not just not to work, but for just tooling Coming around. Out. Yeah. Definitely. So. There was dog hair on that. Of course there was. Mm -hmm. Okay, I think that is really it. That totally random Target haul. We love Target. Yeah. <gasps> One of my favorite places just to go, see what you're going to see there. Yes, definitely. Yeah. All right. Well, I hope you <laughs> liked this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. And you will uh, subscribe to my channel for future videos. That would be awesome. Mm -hmm. And uh, we'll see you real soon in another video. Yeah. Bye. 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 Ben, Kendall, and Kiefer are downstairs. They're all watching a movie. And Kiefer's just like, I think they're so happily. And Ben's like, don't go in there! Don't go! You went in there! And I'm like... What? Oh, he's talking to the movie. <laughs> yes. And I'm like, I'm not doing bag beards again. 